Hey, what's up? This is Casey with The Division Productions. Today I'm going to show you how to make a quick clipping mask in Illustrator. So it's really simple and here's basically what we're going to do. I have this picture of this Rockstar can and I want to put it on my nice background here. And so the problem is it's a picture that's shot on a white background. And so I want to take this background out and just leave this can. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to trace around this can and make a mask. And then I'm going to use that mask to clip out the parts that I don't want. I'm going to choose my pen tool and I'm going to start drawing around this can. And the idea being that I'm going to make a perfect outline around this can. And I'm just holding down the space bar. When I pull out this handle, I can hold down the space bar and move it around. Once I have it in place, I can move the handles with my mouse. And once I like it, it'll fill it in and I can keep going. And to bring those handles out, all I do is just hold my mouse down. And so I can hold it down and drag. That brings out my handles, move it around with the space bar. But I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to close my path. And there's my path and I'm going to make it red just so it's easy to see and refine my mask a little bit and once I have my mask pretty much where I want it to be all I have to do is select my mask and my original image and I can right click on both of them and go to make clipping mask and so everything that's inside of this mask it's going to keep and then everything outside it's going to throw away so I'm going to say make clipping mask and there we go now I have my can on my background. And if I want to change this, and if I want to change my mask, I can double click on the edge and it will bring it up into isolation mode and I can edit my edge just like any path. I can even double click again and move my original image around. And if I decide I don't like it and I really want to start over, I can right click on this group and I can release my clipping mask and that brings everything back to normal. But I'll just make the clipping mask. Looks great. That's how you cut something out really quick and dirty way in Illustrator. 